welcome back to some five of Sarah. Today I'm going to be bringing you guys into my pantry. So we are going to just get this organized. All right, so my first plan of action is to pull everything out to add some space into my closet. Uh, we have this big area that I was keeping like my broom, my mop. I ended up moving most of those items. And I just have this blue um, little cart that I had, oops, that I had in my back room. And so I decided to put that in here so I could have some more space. And obviously I've been keeping some stuff in some of my different cupboards. So I'm gonna try and bring most of it here and try and get it into a good organized place. And hopefully this will be able to give you some motivation to go through your pantry, declutter, organize, get some systems put in, and let's do this together, okay? organizing um, all of this stuff and get it ready to go back in and also I'm going to be placing items in this box that I no longer want to keep uh, that I can pass on to somebody else who will be able to use them and benefit from them. So that's what I'm going to do right now. And definitely um, this time of year there's tons of people who don't have food, um, tons of food shelters in different places that you can donate food to. So um, this is a great option. You can clear out your pantry, send off food, um, and even clear out stuff items that you would be able to use, but then you want to be able to uh, send to someone else. So um, let's get started. All right, so the first item I'm going to pass on is this pure vegetable oil. Um, I don't really want to use this anymore. I'm trying to um, get rid of things I don't really want to be feeding to my body. So this is one thing I'm going to be getting rid of. Okay, another big thing to be able to make your pantry look more organized is to decant, so just get rid of any big bulky boxes, especially when you take the packages out. And that way I can get rid of this box. Also, I love these bins from Target. They have this squared bottom, which um, Walmart has bins that look like this, but they generally, um, when I've gone there, they have like more of a curved edge, and so you can't fit as much in, and I don't really like those. Definitely go for ones at Target, just because they have the squared edge, so you'll be able to fit more in. And it's just going to look a lot nicer with the clean edges. And what I do is I place items in, and then uh, you can either place labels. I just have a wet erase marker that I can put on whatever I want to, and then I can always wet it and erase it and change it out just in case I don't really have this item. These are the Log Cabin Syrup. They have no high fructose corn syrup, so I'm going to, so I was really excited about these, but they still have a lot of sugar in them, so I'm going to get rid of these. And I have another one that um, is used. So we're actually getting sugar out of our house just because um, it doesn't make us feel good and there's a ton of like health risks. Uh, we're trying to decrease the amount of sugar that we have and we're replacing that with um, monk fruit sweetener. So um, that's why we're going to pass this one on as well. I can probably give this to one of my siblings who will be able to use it. And so that's what I did. All right, so I'm going to make more space so that I can get everything onto this that I can be able to group things together and get ready to put stuff back in. Also, 
if you guys are wondering, um, I'm going to send um, most of this probably to my siblings and just let them go through it. I have quite a few siblings and um, I just know that they'll definitely go get some use out of it. Um, if any of you guys don't know, just so you guys know. Cool fact about me, I have 10 siblings. So, anyways, I'm going to definitely pass them on. I'm one of the youngest ones. So, quick fun fact for that. Okay, I'm also going to declutter this. This is full of sugar. And as I said, I'm going to be moving on to bunk fruit. So, I'm going to get rid of this. Okay. I'm going to put my pancake mix underneath this. Okay, so real quick, right now I'm just working on condensing different containers and just getting anything I don't want out so that way I can put it back in a way that I'll be able to find things easily and be able to keep it organized. And when stuff comes in, I'll be able to quickly put things in there proper place. Okay, I also have these creamy peanut butters and um, they like right after roasted peanuts is sugar so there's a lot of sugar content in these so I'm going to get rid of these and then we also have a lot of prepackaged items and a lot of the ingredients uh, just really aren't good for you so I'm just going to get rid of all of these as well so my goal is to just keep the items that I'm going to be able to use to take care of my body and um, I can't remember, there. so there's this TED talk, and it's essentially just talking why like sugar and carbohydrates, like those things just really aren't good for you and how like um, over time, it may result in you needing to get insulin injections. And um, she was talking about all the benefits of taking out sugar, the bad sugars from your life, like skin benefits, health benefits, you won't be as irritable, all these things. She's a great um, resource. She pretty much, at seven, she starts having to take insulin um, injections. Also, um, a couple of my sisters have been um, trying to be eating healthy as well. And so, yeah, so I'm just going to be letting go of stuff that I really don't want to hold me back. Um, and also, there are some items that I'm going to keep. And uh, this lady was talking about how eating 80% of the time, eating really good whole foods, and then eating the kind of crappier foods about 20% of the time. For the most part, I want to let go of those items that aren't going to be good for me or my family health wise. So I love this bin. I'm just going to put big prepackaged items in there. Okay, there's a little bit right here. I'm just going to finish snacking on it um, throughout the day. to do this challenge, so I'm going to be passing these on. Okay, so now I'm gonna be focusing on um, getting mostly the canned goods um, put back. And I'm gonna quickly empty the blue cart that I had in there so that I can place, I think that's where I want to place most of the canned goods back. So in here I have canned chicken and also um, some spaghetti sauce. So I'm just going to be placing any that I have on the counter into here. canned chicken I have and how much um, pasta sauce I have and again I know that some of these still aren't the healthiest but I also want to get rid of uh, just kind of also sending that note to my mind hey we're not going to be buying these items anymore and so from here on out I can be purchasing items that are going to be healthy for us Thank you. 
And then after that, um, if there's anything left, I'm just going to get rid of those. We're gonna um, buy much rice after that. Um, and here we have white flour, which until I switch over to almond flour, I'm going to keep this. And then I have some chocolate chips and some sugar. So I am going to be getting rid of the sugar now. Okay, so I'm also getting rid of these two. All right, so it is a little bit later now. Um, but I am going to just quickly finish. Okay, so I ended up cleaning out these two containers and um, this container that I got rid of earlier that had the sugar. I ended up taking out the sugar and I'm just going to um, get rid of this as the bag. And then, and then I ended up getting the rice that I had. And so I put some in this bag and the rest in this green container um, so that now my rice isn't in that big bag. So that will reduce 
the chances of it getting tipped over and falling out. Um, we are getting rid of the brown sugar. Um, I started separating them, but then, anyways, so I'm getting rid of that though. And then I also had some of these in the other room. There's a couple left. Um, I realized that whenever I eat these, I seem to always, always get a headache where I have to take some medicine for it. So I'm going to be getting rid of these and just giving them to my brother. He loves these. There's not a ton left and um, therefore I was going to try and just eat the rest, but honestly, I don't need any more headaches. So I'm just going to get rid of these. So now I'm just going to place everything back in here. And then I have both of these empty, which over time, I'm going to find some of the items that I have in the closet and I'm gonna put them in here. But this is all I have energy for today. And so I'm just gonna place those back. And then I also have some semi-sweet chocolate chips. And then my rice, I'm just going to put it back under this counter where it was before. All right, and that is it. I am going to also move this rice to where the other rice is because there is extra room now. Mm -hmm. 